Hi, welcome to another following video. This is going to be number three in the series on creating uh, digital um, art uh, from your photos in GIMP using um, um, Photo Sketcher. Um, basically, what I've done here is I've loaded up a picture. Uh, if you read the last program, it's on operation of the program, so I'm not going to go into a lot of it. But I've loaded up a picture here. And basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to call up my uh, dialog. Uh, my drawing parameters dialog, and I'm going to come over here to um, Pencil Sketch 3, and I'm going to create my first image. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, possibly darken it slightly. I mean, that was lightening it. Darkening it slightly, uh, bringing up the color intensity just a hair, uh, the stroke length just a hair to emphasize the effect um, the edge intensity up just a hair. And uh, what I'm going to do is tell it to draw it. And it draws our nice um, uh, chalk effect, color chalk effect. I'm going to come up here to edit. And I'm going to tell it to copy the drawing to the clipboard. Now, I'm going to come over to GIMP. And I'm going to come to Edit, and I'm going to say Paste as New Image. Okay, now, there is the new image. Take it up to 100%, so it, pretty, it kind of fits the screen. <coughs> now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open the original image as a layer. So I'm going to come up here to File. I'm going to open as a layer. And we're going to have to go to the original directory, which was down here under pictures. And under here, and emails, and JPEGs. And it was image J2. Okay, now what we have here is we have a relationship where we have two layers. One of the one that we did in um, uh, Photo Sketcher, and the other one uh, we've, uh, you know, is just the original picture. So we're going to move this Photo Sketcher layer up on top. And what I'd like to do at this point is I'd like to bring out a little bit more detail on the face. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over, uh, number one, on uh, this top layer. I'm going to come to my layers and make sure that the alpha layer, or the transparency, is uh, in effect, and it is. So now I'm going to come over to here <coughs> using my eraser tool. Okay. Bring this over here. And I'm going to select a fuzzy circle. And I'm going to take the op opacity down to about, like, let's say, 40 or 50 percent and scale it up large. And now what I can do is I can come over to my picture. And as I erase off this top layer, I expose the layer underneath, which is the photograph. And if you'll notice, to whichever degree that I prefer, I can bring out that photorealistic detail and leave some of that nice effect that was created by the um, uh, Photo Sketcher program. So now basically I've revealed detail within that picture. So what I'm going to do is I'm now going to go back over to my Photo Sketcher program, Photo Sketcher program, and I'm going to recall up my drawing parameters. I'm going to lighten that substantially. Okay, which I've done. And uh, the stroke length, um, what I'm going to do 
is go, I'm going to take that back and my edge intensity back slightly. I'm going to tell it to draw it. Okay. And if you notice, we have a much more muted effect. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to say edit, edit and uh, copy the drawing to the clipboard. I'm going to come back over into my program. I'm going to go to edit and I'm going to paste it as a new layer. So over top I have a much lighter layer. So what I'm going to do now is again I know that my uh, alpha layer is in place but we'll check it. Yes it has transparency um, involved. So now we're going to come over here to our lasso tool and I'm going to cut out the center well, one thing that we got to do first of all. So we've got to come over to here and set our feather edges to a very high radius. And now, using my lasso tool, Okay, I've done that. Now what I can do here is do a delete. And if you'll notice, what I have done here is um, I've made a three-layer image. I'll select all. Where the top layer is just this light shadow around the outside. The center layer <coughs> is my photo sketcher effect of the... Um, of the pastel drawing and then the lower layer is my photograph. So my photograph is shining through the detail. Uh, the center layer is providing a more dramatic effect in the center and the outer layer is providing the outer effect. Now the point is you can combine uh, the oil uh, painting effect and several of the other effects together and really uh, produce dramatic results. Um, I really highly recommend getting this program a nice guy and contribute so that he will continue putting more algorithms and enhancements into that software. And uh, thank you for watching. Please visit his site. <coughs> That's uh, photosketcher.com and uh, my site uh, www.photolink That's f o t o l i n q.com um, for more training and photographic videos. Um, Keep an eye on this guy, this uh, Dave at uh, Photo Sketcher. I can uh, see that he's really going to produce some nice things. Uh, thank you very much for watching.